Namo Buddhaya. Dear meritorious devotees and my dear children, have you ever been criticized by someone in your life? We all have been in that situation in all of our lives. No one can stop other people to criticize us. That is something that is out of our control. You have to keep it in your mind. Criticism, blames, scoldings and other people's opinions in our life is something that we cannot control by ourselves. That is called the things are out of our control. So we cannot stop for other person to judge us. Now, normally the nature of people is always they are judging us. They keep on judging, they keep on criticizing and we cannot stop them. Once our great teacher Supreme Buddha explained this to a Brahmin called Atula. Supreme Buddha said, Purana metang Atula, netang ajatanamiva. Supreme Buddha explained, Atula, it came from the ancient time. Nindanti tunhi maasina. People will criticize us when we become silent. Nindanti bahubanina. People will criticize when a person who is talking too much. When we sp speak moderately, when we live our life moderately, people may criticize us. There's no person, there's not a single person who has not been criticized by someone in this world. This verse shows us we all have been criticized in this life. We all have been, that, been in that situation in our life. So it is a common phenomena or common incident that we have to face in our life. So how to face these criticisms? Well, there are two types of criticisms in our life. One is the criticisms or the criticizers that which helps us to develop our good qualities. Now the people who always wish the good of us, our parents, our teachers, our elders, may advise you. Like they may criticize our faults. When we face or when we are in such situations, always listen to those criticisms. Always listen to those advices. Do not consider it as a bad thing. Do not consider it as a negative criticism. It is a positive criticism. You can develop the good qualities and you can make your faults correct when you listen to those advices. So they are called positive criticism. And there's another criticism and then that is the negative criticizing. People may criticize out of jealous. People may criticize us out of anger. They always keep on criticizing it. We cannot stop it. So when we face such situations, the nature of this mind is we become sad, we become depressed. The anxiety will start to develop inside our mind. And what we do is when we face and when we hear those criticism to our life, we stop the good things, good practices that we are practicing in our life. You should not do that. You should not give up practicing the merits. You should not give up doing good deeds because of others' words. Dear meritorious children, and my dear devotees, do not be backed down from criticizing. Face that. Listen to that. But never stop the good of your life. Never stop doing the good in your life. So we all have to face this common incident in our life.
life. So the more we face the criticism in our life, the more we will have the opportunity to build up good qualities within ourselves. So don't think the criticism as a bad thing. They help you to develop good qualities in your life. When you face negative criticism, always be patient. Always be kind towards them. Because they have judged us, they have come to a conclusion about us, which is wrong. So what we have to do, we should not argue with them. We should not try to talk back. We should not try to prove them that they are wrong. So what we have to do, just be silent. Just be patient and always keep on practicing and never stop doing the good deeds and good practices in your life. If you keep on practicing the good things in your life, your life will be successful. It is the nature that when we start doing something good, something wholesome, or when we start uh, doing a service to this world, something good to this world, it is the nature we all face the criticism. All the people who had done a great service to this world, even our great teacher Supreme Buddha faced criticism. So there's nothing to talk about us. So what we have to do, we have to face those criticism. The more we face the criticism in our life, the more our life will be beautiful. So, don't just go through your life. Always grow through your life. When you face those hard times and uh, difficulties in your life, you will always grow through your life. Namo Buddhaya Thiruvansaranaya.